what's going on? In this video, I'm gonna show you guys exactly how I'm styling my bump at 32 weeks. So being like five and six months is all well and good and cute and you have like this nice little, you know, round bump. It's obvious that you're pregnant, but it's not like this huge thing yet. And it's like somewhat easy to style that. You still kind of can fit into your old clothes a little bit depending, maybe not pants, but other things. And then you slowly start to creep up to like eight months, eight and a half months, and then nine months. And it's no longer easy anymore. You need full-blown maternity clothes, and you have a watermelon in your stomach. So this video is really for styling the huge, big bumps. I found I couldn't really find a ton of content on this. A lot of bump styling videos are more in like the five, six, possibly even seven month range. And I'm 32 weeks, so that's eight months, and I still have two months to go, and it's the summer out right now. So I have been trying to find really cute ways to style my bump and still feel comfortable because that more than ever is top priority at this point in pregnancy, at least for me anyway. I am already uncomfortable, but then put on uncomfortable clothes and it's just like not gonna happen. In some of my other videos, which I'll link for you guys, I've sort of labeled myself as self-proclaimed maternity clothes snob. For me personally, I, I find it's really easy for me to look frumpy and not my best. So I have been really strict on keeping it simple. I've leaned more neutral. I've done more things with more accessories and shoes versus like the actual clothes because I feel like the bump is like sort of the big thing in your outfit. And I've really, really made a conscious effort to stay in the fitted realm. So I've stuck to fitted clothes, not tight and uncomfortable clothes, but things that are fitted. Because what I sort of thought in my head was, anytime I put on something like oversized, like I used to wear a lot of oversized t-shirts when I wasn't pregnant, because you, you can pull it off. You, it's obvious that it's oversized. <laughs> and then you're like this fit, kind of person underneath, so it worked. But now if I were to wear an oversized t-shirt, it just gets tight around my stomach, like loose around my boobs, and then like these other weird pockets, like it just, it does not work at all. So I've been really focused on like fitted dresses, fitted skirts, fitted leggings with like crop tops, and really like sort of showing off my bump that way. But it's to the point now where it's hot and fitted stuff I can only wear for a certain amount of time and then I just max out. I like can't even breathe. I'm so uncomfortable and I just need to like be free. So thanks to Pink Blush Maternity, they sent me um, a couple of really cute options and I went a little bit more flowy and loose this time. So I'm really gonna challenge myself to still make the outfits look cute and not look frumpy as I feel like I can often look. I also try to keep reminding myself I only have two more months to go, eight weeks, it's not very long, but at the same time, that's two months. And I, I wanna feel the best that I possibly can. I wanna look cute and I wanna feel good when I'm walking out my door, even if it's just to go to the doctor. I think that does wonders on your mental health. It really helps your energy feel raised and up. And those things are extremely important for this stage in your pregnancy. So I'm gonna do like a little bit of a micro unboxing quickly. Um, and I just wanna show you what Pink Flush Maternity sent me. So we've got this really cute sort of like baby doll. It's technically a leopard dress, but it almost really doesn't look leopard. Like I guess that's technically a leopard pattern, but I feel like it's just a really cute neutral piece. You can't really see the whole thing right now, but I'm gonna try it on for you afterwards so you'll totally know what it looks like. Uh, so we're working with this and it's good to note that I got this in a medium. I find their stuff fits very well and it's true to size. Even when I looked on the website, the model that was wearing this is 5'9 and she was wearing a small and I'm only 5'6 so I was like, should I get a small? But then I'm like, you know what? If we're gonna go loose, Let's just do it properly. And in case I grow more in the next two months or whatever, I just really wanted to make sure that I had enough room and enough space to just like feel good because I have fitted clothes that I can just wear if I wanna wear something fitted. So this is the next piece. I'm calling it the Camel Romper. It is a very beautiful summery sort of like camel color. And it's just a very simple, comfortable romper. So you can see that it's connected there. 
Um, the fabric is so soft and comfortable, you guys. This has been definitely a go-to piece for me. Like when I jump out of the shower and you just need to put anything on like super fast, I'll literally just like throw this on and then get ready and then I can, you know, put my outfit together afterwards. But also with that being said, I can totally wear this out too. One thing I will say about this though is I got a large because that was the only size that they had left and that's how badly I wanted this because I could just tell how comfortable it was on the website. With that being said, I would have preferred a medium now that I've tried it on, but for the outfits that I'm gonna show you guys, I'm just gonna clamp it at the back a little bit so you get a better feel of how it's supposed to fit. And then going out and stuff too, it's not the end of the world. Like it doesn't look oversized because I have a massive watermelon in my stomach. So um, it's really hard to tell, I notice, but with the right accessories and whatnot, uh, I think it'll look fine. So just a good note there, um, when you're shopping at Pink Blush, definitely make sure to get the size that you normally are because they are really good at adjusting for your bump and making sure that their clothing is true to size. So those are the main pieces I'm working with today and I'm going to show you guys some outfits, some different style ideas, and I hope you enjoy. All right, that's it for this video. I hope you ladies got some ideas to style your bigger bumps. I hope you're doing well and feeling comfortable in your pregnancies. If you guys wanna see me trying new things twice a week, please subscribe to my channel and you can also follow me on Instagram for more.